For those of you new to our channel, we are Rhonda and Joe with RVing with the Maracas. In this video, we're going to share with you Baker's Hole Campground and our trip to Yellowstone National Park. We found this beautiful campground by looking at the Campendium website, a very useful website with reviews and information about campgrounds. Baker's Hole Campground has 73 sites and 33 sites with electric hookups. Some of the sites are first come, first serve, and we felt lucky to get Site 25, a perfect back-end site near the entrance at only about three miles from West Yellowstone, and the entrance to Yellowstone National Park. The campground is beautiful with lots of trees and a beautiful river. It is open from May to the end of September. We paid $18 per night with our America the Beautiful Pass discount. All right, this is our last morning in West Yellowstone. We just closed the slide and there was ice on top of it. It had rained a few days ago, lightly. And, yep, that's ice. <laughs> I couldn't believe when it's on the top. It's <laughs> ice. <laughs> and Rhonda, is it cold out here? It's cold out here. <laughs> so what would you think of our campground? I like this campground. I come back here. Yeah, especially if I can get an electric site. Yeah, come back. Had a nice gravel pad, nice paved pad. Um, roads in the campground. We are in kind of the first site and we were able to use hoses to connect to the fresh water. Inside. Yeah, overall things are good with the uh, outdoors RV. We were so excited to be at Yellowstone National Park once again. The major crowds had calmed down toward the end of August and this proved to be a good time to visit. We did not see as many animals as we had in the past, but we really enjoyed the hiking, visiting the canyon area, seeing all the geysers, visiting Old Faithful, seeing the paint pots, and many other trails. We went into the park most days with our National Park Pass because there was no entrance fee if you had that pass. We hope you enjoy the video and photos. We look forward to returning to this area once again in the future. We visited Canyon Village and the Grand Canyon of Yellowstone. This is an absolutely beautiful area. We hiked some of the trails and down to this waterfall and have to admit it was a bit strenuous hiking back up. There were lots of people in the park, but we recommend going early as we did on some of the days and this really helped with the crowds. The Old Faithful area is very nice. There's shopping, there's food, and there's a wonderful boardwalk where you can walk through lots and lots of geyser areas. We're here at Old Faithful, and there's just so many of these geysers. That one looks like a perfect bathtub. Rhonda, what time did we get up to come here today? We got up about 5 o'clock this morning. Left the house at 6.30. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Yep, it was great. And we still had to wait in a little bit of a line mm -hmm. at the entrance.
Hot Springs Terrace was a beautiful area. There were nice boardwalks and a beautiful sunset while we were there. There were many places to hike and enjoy the landscape. We were there at the end of our trip and will definitely visit this end of the park near Gardner the next time around. Lake Trail. Here we go. It's only half a mile in, half a mile out. So that'll be good. So this is still part of Harlequin Trail. Um, we're, um, we just came down that path right there. You can really see where animals have um, come close to the lake. They've eaten a lot of the grass and came down to get some water. Um, luckily we have not encountered anything. Oh, a snake. Oh, we did see a snake. It was a skank, I think. Look, that's what it looked like. Pretty big one. We were in the area for seven days and went into the park at least five of the days. The park is huge and there's so much to see. We went in early on most days so we could avoid the crowds, and this really seemed to work for us. Again, we stayed in West Yellowstone and exited the park through Cody, Wyoming. Enjoy the final pictures and video. We are so looking forward to being out in that area again. Thanks for watching and be sure to like the video and subscribe if you're new to our channel. Feel free to leave us a comment and tell us what you think. We'll be happy to respond.